Hello everyone, my name is Kushbu. I welcome to you all in this statistics video lecture series again. So in my previous video already I have explained about what is population data, what is sample data, what is measure of central tendency, what is descriptive statistics and inferential statistics as well. So if you haven't watched those videos, please go and check out that. In this particular video, I am going to discuss with you about one of the very very important topic inside statistics which may be asked in the interview as a theoretical question which is random variable and its type. Yes, we will be discussing about what exactly is random variable and what are the different different types of random variable. First of all, let us understand about what is random variable. So, if you are someone who belongs from a coding background who used to code, so that you might have seen that we used to create a variable where we used to store some kind of values. Such as, if I need to store any kind of numerical variable, we used to write like this, x is equal to let's say 12. Even this value can be string, such as I can store a, right? So either it could be numerical value, either it could be a categorical or string kind of value. So here in this case, let me just uh, write it as y. So here in this case, this x and y is what? This is a kind of variable, right? In a similar way, inside statistics, this random variable is a kind of variable where we used to store some values so that we can use it wherever we want. All right, now moving towards its type, like what are the different different types of random variable we will see. So there are basically two types of random variable. The first one is quantitative random variable. I'll be writing RV as short form of random variable. And the second one is qualitative random variable. All right. So these two are the two types of random variable. Now this quantitative random variable is also sometimes referred as numerical variable, numerical random variable or you can say it as numerical random variable is also called as quantitative random variable. Also this qualitative random variable is called as categorical random variable. All right. So these two are basically the uh, like other name for the same that is quantitative random variable is also called as numerical random variable whereas qualitative random variable is also called as categorical random variable. Alright, so let us uh, first understand what is quantitative random variable and what is qualitative random variable. So this quantitative random variable as the name suggests is also referred as numerical random variable. So the kind of data which is in the form of numbers is considered as numerical random variable. Now again this quantitative random variable is divided into two types that is discrete and continuous. All right, you can say it as discrete numerical random variable and continuous numerical random variable. Also, this categorical random variable or qualitative random variable is divided into two types. What are that? Those are nominal. random variable and here ordinal qualitative random variable. Alright, so this numerical random variable is divided into two types that is discrete numerical random variable and continuous numerical random variable whereas this qualitative random variable is again divided into two types that is nominal qualitative random variable and ordinal qualitative random variable. We will discuss about each one of these types so that you will be able to understand what exactly is quantitative and qualitative random variable. Let's first discuss about discrete numerical random variable and continuous one. So inside discrete numerical random variable, the variable which is in the form of whole number that falls, such as 
you can take it uh, you can take an example as number of children in family if i ask you how many members are there in your family you are going to tell it as 5 10 or uh, let's say 3 or 4 you are not going to say at any point of time that there is 4.5 members in your family all right so this is a kind of example that is of discrete quantitative random variable all right or discrete numerical random variable numbers of children in the family now an, another example of discrete random variable is age if you have to fill out some form and you have to mention the age you are not going to mention your age as 22.5 right uh, again you are not going to mention it as 15.2 whenever you are going to mention you are going to mention your age in a kind of whole number right where is no such decimal included so those kind of variable is uh, like falls under discrete uh, numerical random variable now the next type of numerical random variable is continuous numerical random variable i'll give you one example of continuous numerical random variable if i ask that what is the temperature in your town or in your city so you are going to tell just a second temperature so you are going to tell it's 32.5 degrees celsius or let's say it could be 23.2 degrees celsius so this temperature is a kind of number which is not always in the form of whole right so this can uh, this is in the form of continuous one that is why it is considered as continuous numerical random variable also one more example is of weight if you are going to measure your weight, it may be um, 58.2 or let's say 60.0. This kind of number which is in the form of continuous form that is termed as continuous numerical random variable. I hope you understood about the difference of discrete and continuous random variable. Now let's move out to the qualitative random variable and its type. Let's first understand about nominal and ordinal. So, this nominal qualitative random variable is something where rankings or orders are not important. I'll write here, rankings or orders are not important. Whereas, in ordinal qualitative random variable, this rankings or orders are important. Now, what I mean by this rankings and order, I'll tell you. Uh, like in our childhood, uh, we used to see in our class that their rankings are important. Whenever our exams are over, uh, we used to get the result where we used to get first rank, second rank, and third rank. So that were actually important. So that can be an example of this uh, ordinal random variable or ordinal qualitative random variable where orders or rankings are important whereas if i take an example for this nominal qualitative random variable so i can take it as uh, gender okay gender wherein you can find out male and female so uh, do you think that in this male and female there are some kind of rankings or orders no these two are of equal category and equal importance you can say all right whereas here you can take it as um, toppers rank in the class toppers rank in the class all right so this is the example of ordinal qualitative random variable and this gender is an example of nominal qualitative random variable now i'll give you one more example of these two so that you will get some more clarity for the example of ordinal qualitative random variable you can take it as customer rating okay customer rating So you would have noticed that whenever we used to call uh, to customer care executive at the end of the call, they used to ask for rating, right? Some kind of rating based on our experience.
experience so that particular rating is very very important for them because at the end it used to decide their performance so this customer rating can be an example of ordinal qualitative random variable now for this nominal qualitative random variable it can be like the example can be or uh, tossing a coin okay tossing coin so if i toss a coin there could be two possibility of getting one is head and the other one is tail so there is no such orders or ranking defined uh, defined for this head and tail these two are of equal importance so this can be taken as the example of this nominal qualitative random variable so this is all about random variable and its types. I'll just uh, summarize you once more. So this random variable is a kind of variable where we used to store the values so that we can use that value wherever we want. This random variable is divided into two types. That is quantitative random variable, which is also called as numerical random variable. And the second is qualitative random variable, which is also called as categorical random variable now these two random these two types of random variable is again divided into two two types that is the quantitative random variable is divided into discrete and continuous whereas qualitative random variable is divided into two types that is nominal and ordinal and these are the examples of these two types which i have taken for explanation if you have missed it so please go back and see once more so I hope you would have understood about what is random variable and what are its type. If you have any kind of question, you can ask in the comment section. That's it for this video. Till then, keep learning and stay tuned for getting the latest videos from this channel. Thank you so much.